What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. It is a little brisk day, but me and Austin are out here. Austin's doing some more cleaning and organizing while I get to work on trying to finish welding out this cage. So y'all enjoy the video, get to work. Yeah, I know. Austin hates the long stuff. But uh, you can see the inside is completely cleaned out, 100% welded out. I got the upper bars done. So y'all saw I had to do some modifications and trim them pieces, which is normal for a Dickinson cage. You have to trim these because of how far back and forward you put that. So dad is going to do one more little bit of touch up on that back uh, B pillar post back there for the main hoop. While he's doing that, I'm about to come in here and take all of this wiring harness out so that I can tuck it real nice like we did the eight, get rid of things and zip tie things up that don't need to be in there. And then all this uh, airbag system and stuff's coming out and then all these wires are getting moved up so there won't be any wires down here. So we'll come back when we're done with that and show you guys how it looks. All right, so huge pro progress update. We got the radiator back in, or that's going in. We got the T-bar bracket in. The seat, the stock seat, dad is running this stock seat just for this fried bologna. The cage is completely welded. All of the wiring's done, so you guys can see. We got rid of a lot. And yeah, this, do not mind that. I know uh, my buddy Steven actually dissected this wiring harness on his and got rid of it. But for now, that's going to ride. Um, but it's a lot nicer. We did it just like the 8 car. So everything is put up nice and neat up out of the way. Gauge cluster will go right here. And then we'll build our dash just like, you know, the rest of them. But uh, I'm liking it. All we have left to do now is start doing the stuff that I love the most. Put the deck lid on. Start sheet metaling, putting the doors on, sheet metal them. Dad got this fender on. We got to put the hood on, put the front bumper on. They've been straightening out some of the bumpers. But the main thing is why they've been, I've been working. Austin's been still super cleaning. So y'all check this out. We got this car. We got the pig. Dad's. The Falcon, which... The Falcon's looking rough, but she still runs and drives amazing. So a little bit of an update on this. I know that we guys, uh, we told you guys in the last video that Kevin's motor, we will be getting ready to pull in the K9 car. They've got this thing ready to drop in. So K9's car is sitting right over there. That'll be coming in soon. But you can see we've been making more progress on the dirt, bringing the dirt in. So now we'll be able to park cars over there when we clean, finish cleaning that. But the pig car is now running and driving. The front end is done. So Austin drove this thing down the street. We have some major surgery work that's got to go on right here. 
So we'll more than likely do a video on that, just pulling everything out on that. The Falcon needs uh, a whole week's worth of work, probably. But um, it's just mainly cosmetic stuff on Austin's. We've got the engine running top notch. A little bit of update on Dad's. Still sore subject. Let's talk with Dad about it. Dad, we bought the ECU from uh, the guy. Thank you to Mr. Steve Edens. He got that, but unfortunately, that was not the problem. Oh, well, no, what it is now. But Austin's, like Austin's saying, it was somewhat of the problem. It runs better now, right? It runs better. So the ECU did help, but what we is had, it? We had idle issues and stuff. Now the ECU fixed all that. But so what do what do we ha what is it still doing? We've got a specialist looking into it. <laughs> Who is the specialist? I know a real one. This time. All right. So Dad, you're saying we got to bring that car to an actual Honda shop, and we're gonna see if they can figure it out. But we have one more thing we're gonna try, right? With the fuel pump. Yeah. We're gonna direct wire the fuel pump up and see if that helps it out. So, all right. So the next game plan is to try to fabricate this so that it's nice and in there, right? So it doesn't move and go all over the place. And Dad's gonna get this fender on. And really, like I said, it's just getting everything else ready. So. I'm going to call it a video here. Um, thank you guys for hanging out with us today. We made a lot of progress on this car. We've got to put the door plate on and do a few minor odd and end things. But the next video, hey, do you mind? <laughs> the next video that you guys see, hopefully this car is done and will be finished. So we'll do one more video of this car with us completely getting it all back together before we bring it and reveal it at the track so you guys will see it one more time y'all be on the lookout for a pig video be on the lookout for a canine video so i can give you an update on them and a pure stock video coming so uh this car you got one more on this car for the final reveal canine pig and another pure stock so thank you guys for uh tuning in y'all be blessed we'll see you guys in the next one